Hi you guys and welcome back to What's Up with Toria. So today I just wanted to give you girls a quick rundown of my favorite places to shop for shoes online. Now, I'm gonna give you guys this rundown because it is wide feet friendly. Why am I mentioning wide feet? Well, I have wider feet. And because of that, I can't just really shop for any shoe in a particular size and expect for it to always fit. And I'm pretty sure that's how shoes all around are. But specifically for people with wider feet, if the shoe is not specifically made for a wide fit, we usually have to go up half a size or sometimes even a full size, which is something that I have to do um, a lot if I am shopping for a shoe that is not specifically designed for wider feet. So with that being said, let's jump right into it. So number five, the fifth place that I love shopping for my shoes at the most has got to be Nasty Girl. I got a pair of boots from them actually. And what I love about these Nasty Girl shoes is that not only are they extremely comfortable, I can dance in them. Um, these are a size 10 in the US, but in the UK, they're a size eight. I usually wear a size nine and a half, but Nasty Girl does not have white fit shoes. So instead, I just picked up these in a size 10 and even though these shoes are not a nine and a half, and even though they're not a wide fit shoe, they still fit really, really, really comfortable and they feel like a perfect fit for me. So I have these black booties that I love to dance in. And yes, I said dance because I love dancing in heels and I actually take little dance classes so that I can get better because I have so much like, I have too much social anxiety to practice in front of a group. So um, yeah, these are the heels. They're really comfortable, fashionable. They don't get dirty easily, even though I don't really wear them outside the house unless I'm dancing in them. So one thing that I did actually end up putting in these heels are gel pads. Now I only put these gel pads at the, um, at the heel part of my foot inside of these boots, only because when I'm dancing and my feet are sweating, sometimes my feet tend to like be a bit slippery in my shoes. So to prevent me from feeling like I'm about to slide in my heels, I put those gel pads um, in my shoes. Yeah, so moving on. Uh, my fourth favorite place to shop online for shoes at is da -da -da -da, Macy's, yes. Macy's and in particular Nike. So uh, these are shoes that I got from Macy's.com and they are just some regular Nike um, running shoes. I'm not really sure which Nike running shoe they are, but I do know that they're really, really comfortable. And guess what size these are, you guys? A nine and a half. Yep, they're nine and a half. So I love Nike shoes because nine times out of 10, they're gonna fit true to size and they always stretch. These shoes fit perfectly for me. I usually don't really wear tennis shoes with like outfits. Like I don't go out wearing tennis shoes. That's just me though. So moving on to our third favorite shoe store, we have Windsor. So Windsor um, is actually like a clothing store, but they have such amazing everything in there. Like their clothes are amazing, shoes, accessories, jacket, they got you. Windsor actually reminds me of a better version of Forever 21. And it is really the classy version of Fashion Nova because I noticed that Fashion Nova has a lot of beautiful clothes, do not get me wrong, but a lot of their clothes are not very wholesome. And I noticed that at Windsor, they kind of tone down the raunchiness. Yeah. Now, these shoes are not a wide fit. They are just a size 10. Um, I believe Windsor is actually an American based brand. Listen, I could be wrong, you guys, please don't quote me, but these shoes are definitely really cute. And these are also shoes that I bought to dance in. I do dance in them, but I don't dance in them a lot actually because the bottom of them are a bit slippery. Yeah, I don't know the bottom, I guess they have like fur or whatever, but it makes them a bit harder to dance in. Yes, and like I said, these are a size 10. They're just really, really cute. Well, I did not have to put a gel pad at the bottom of these because I don't really dance in them a lot. So I don't really need the extra grip or support in them. But if I wanted to, I mean, I would.
And by the way, like all of the boxes that you see these shoes in, they originally came in these boxes. This is the box that it, these cheetah shoes came in from windsor.com. So, uh, yeah. So, number two of our favorite shoe stores online belongs to Shoeland. Now, don't let this box fool you because when you see it, you're going to be like, oh my God, it has a huge hole in it. I know. But let me tell you something about Shoeland. Shoeland has a lot of cheap shoes that look amazing, all right? I'm gonna give you an example right freaking now. Yes, it came like this. It was probably because the delivery man was being impatient with the package or not being very careful with it. But I just wanna show you these amazing freaking shoes, you guys, because I swear I wear these to job interviews. I wear these whenever I wanna look more professional, whenever I just wanna make an amazing first impression. They're not a wide fit shoe, but they are a size 10. Now, now I'm gonna tell you a little story about these shoes. So when I first got them, I actually thought that I couldn't fit them. You wanna know why? Because the back of my shoes would come up and there would be so much space in the back of my shoes. And I was so sad because I was thinking like, a size 10 is slightly too big. They don't have a nine and a half as an option and a nine would most definitely be too small. But I ended up putting two heel cushions or two heel grip stickers in the back of these pumps of both of them and they fit perfectly. Um, I'm gonna put the link to these shoes in the description box below so you can definitely check them out. Oh, and by the way, you know these shoes are comfortable. You know these shoes are comfortable. Otherwise, I wouldn't even recommend them, okay? Okay. And I also wanna show you guys another pair of shoes that I got from Shoeland. They're these pair of leather boots and they are so freaking gorgeous. So, these are the boots from Shoeland, yet again, because when I find a place that I love to shop at, when I find a place that has great customer service, great shipping, great prices, friendly people that are working for them, like, I'm going to continue shopping with those people. So I continue to shop with Shoeland. I'm going to show you the other one that I already have lying around my room somewhere. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Now, I know what you guys are thinking, like, oh, she scratched up the boots right here, or, or like, they don't really look brand new, brand new. I've had these boots for a year, you guys. And let me tell you, not only are they comfortable, cute, fall weather, winter weather, it's like, they're just so versatile. And yet again, so comfortable. The heel is not too high, it's not too big, it's just right, you guys. You know, I'm sliding them on right quick. <laughs> Tori is not playing with you all. Tori is not lying to you girls. And listen, I want you guys to know that I accidentally left these shoes out, but I got these from shoeland.com, baby. And these are size 10. And oof, baby, these shoes are sexy. I just wanted you guys to see these booties. The number one shoe store that I, I find myself going to and it is, I don't, I don't want to say it's a guilty pleasure, but it is a guilty pleasure. You want to know why? Because this particular shoe store has wide fit shoes and their shoes are cute. Please, ladies and gentlemen, please, ladies and gentlemen, please give a small or actually a huge round of applause for da 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 torrid.com. So basically, Torrid, I'm not sure what country Torrid is based in. Torrid is actually a plus size women's clothing store, but not only are their clothes beautiful, their shoes are even prettier. And they have wide fit shoes. So these are some black nine and a half wide fit heels that I got from Torrid. They're your typical, you know, black open toe sandal heel. And I put this little gel, well not actually, this isn't a gel cushion pad, this is just a regular cushion pad. You know, I, I was, I, it was hurting a bit right, right in this area when I was walking in them. So I got these. These shoes are cute. Yes, and I feel like every girl needs an essential pair of black open toe heels like this. Like, because these will go with anything. These can, these can basically dress your outfit up 
even when you're wearing something casual. I don't care what anyone says, you're ready to go out. Now, I'm gonna show you one more pair of shoes. These shoes, yet again, they are from torrid.com. You guys, I haven't even wore these yet. You guys, tell me right now. These are a size nine and a half. And to be honest, I really could have went a size nine because these are, I don't wanna say they're too big, but I, I just could have, I could have went a size nine. So, um, yeah. Um, Torrid has a lot of cute sandals. I love getting my flats from there because they're the only place in the whole world I can buy ballet flats that fit great on me because they have their flats in a wide fit size that they sell them in. So they have a size nine or nine and a half or a 10, but you can get it in a wide or a normal size fit, right? So they give you those options, right? I'm gonna give you guys some honorable mentions for this video because even though I have gotten my favorite shoes from these five places, there are about, there are about three other places that I would suggest you check out that are online as well. Number one, Ego. I, I went on their website and I ordered a size 10, right? Let me tell y'all, I ordered that size 10 and some, some mules, some cute mule uh, heels or whatever, and I could not fit them. Um, it's not that the shoe was not wide enough. The shoe was just a bit too tight. It was just a bit too tight. So I guess it was wide enough for me to get my foot in, but it wasn't wide enough for me to be able to walk in them comfortably without feeling like my foot was gonna squeeze out of the freaking shoe, right? So um, I sent those shoes back and I reordered a second pair in a size 11. So, I'm, I may do a review on those shoes or I, I may just, you know, wear them one day and post the, the, a photo of them. Um, what I want you guys to know is that I definitely recommend Ego because I know for a fact their shoes are beautiful. Their shoes fit, um, their shoes fit pretty well. Even though the shoe was not wide enough for me, I understood that if it was wide enough for me, I would have, I cannot wait until those shoes come, okay? Because I know I'm going to be slaying. So the second honorable mention that I'm going to say to you guys is semishoes.com. But they actually have a section for wider fit heels. So if you need heels that are wider fit specifically, they literally have a section for that on their website, which I really appreciate because other people don't really have those options for us wider feet girls. Um, I definitely recommend that you check them out. The third honorable mention, hmm, who do I want to give this to? So the third honorable mention I'm going to go ahead and say is Miss Lulu's and I just lied. What is Miss Lulu's? Miss Lola, they are not wide feet friendly. That's why I don't really recommend them for people with wide feet at all. Even if you go a size up, I would not recommend getting your shoes from Miss Lola because I tried to go a size up and I didn't even see a shoe size that was a size 11. You know what I'm saying? Like with Ego shoes, even though a size 10 did not fit me, at least they had a size 11 that I could order to like make up for the 10 that I could not fit. And I just kind of hate those places, you know, they have a lot of customers and most customers, most women, I understand that they don't fall into the size nine and a half or 10 or 11 or 12. But just because most women don't fall into those shoe sizes, it doesn't mean that there aren't some women that do fall into those shoe sizes. And just growing up, I always noticed that when you have bigger feet as a woman, it is harder finding cuter shoes, finding cuter heels. Like I would go to little stores like Payless, you know, when it was still up and running. I think all the Paylesses have actually been shut down, if I'm not mistaken. And then sometimes I would be like, dang, I feel bad because I can't find any of my size. Come on, I bet they're not so bad. <laughs> And I'm so grateful that I've been able to come across all of these amazing websites. And now I feel like I have a chance of having pretty shoes and pretty heels and pretty flats that fit perfectly too. Just knowing that you have those options in the shoe stores are just really important. So with that being said, I hope you guys have a great rest of your day. I hope you guys are staying safe during this pandemic. I hope you guys are keeping your faith strong keeping your face strong, whatever you have to do, meditate, listen to TD Chase, do a morning run. I've been running every morning and it, it really 
I don't know what it does to my mornings like but running in the morning really gives me a jump start to my day that is the end of this video don't forget to like and subscribe you guys and i will see you girls later bye